Hello you delicious screaming egg sacks, Jim Sterling here, and this is Insane Insects, The Inception. That's some good alliteration, isn't it? Uh, this game is describing itself on Steam as an airborne Quake 3 on steroids. Okay, so that gives us a nice idea of what to expect. We're expecting uh, high-speed thrills in a multiplayer arena. It, it's single player, so we can't expect the multiplayer bit, but but we've still got the airborne steroid stuff. Let's see exactly how like Quake 3 this is. Let's go. Challenge a nest. That's us. And we can go against, I guess, one of these two because that one's locked. Let's, well, we've already got an ant thing here. Let's go with this, I don't know, dinosaur insect thing. I've got options, whatever. We'll just go with this. So, challenge a nest v predator nest. Warm up Angie's diner. That's all we can do. Let's go, play. Here we go, initializing. There's an ant there. Nominally, I mean, it doesn't look exactly like an ant, but it's got antennae and, and mandibles, which is it's a great word, is it not? Man okay, right, this is a thrilling start. It's the sun there. Actually, no, that's an egg. The, the egg is setting in the sky. Got ourselves some giant ass fucking um, cactus, cacti. I don't know why I forgot what to call these things. They are massive, but we are an insect. But actually looking over there, it looks like these cacti might be bigger than the car. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, so what are we doing? So this is it doesn't look like a massive map. Oh! There we go. And that's... That deaded. It can't have its gum. Fair dues, fair dues. I'll be honest with you. Um, I tried recording a, a video of this already and the recording messed up. So I do know a little bit about what's going on. Which is to say, not much. Not much is going on. And there's still bits of it that I don't understand, like whatever that weird electrical storm was. I used to think it was spawn points, like like another enemy was spawning, but as you can see there, sometimes there's nothing here. In fact, a lot about this game consists of nothing being there. This uh, uh, Airborne Quake 3 on steroids game... Is, has pit me, as the player, against one lone AI-controlled insect enemy. Which I think killed itself. That's that dead. Now we've just got to wait for it to come back. Oh, there we are. Just like Quake, everybody. This is exactly like Quake. So here we go, it's uh, spawning relatively nearby. That's not always the case. Oh, we... We are dead because of reasons. That happens a lot with this game. Sometimes you will just to die. Also, the, uh, the colours on the ground, the orange there and the green over here, appear to be poisonous, I think. So we don't go near that. The game's very terrible with uh, audiovisual feedback vis-a-vis -vis damage. For instance, there looks like we're getting shot or something, but no, that's just because we're near. I'm assuming the poison. Dead. Another thing to note with the game is there are there there are no um, ammo. Oh, hang on. Uh, hello. Brilliant! We're stuck in the car. Oh, no, hang on, hang on. Come on! No. Uh, I'm not even touching anything now, it's just making noises. Oh, horrible. Horrible noises. Wow, okay then. Oh, well, hey! <laughs> 10 out of 10, just like Quake. Right, 
on we go. Where's the other one? So it's a very small map, but because you are just fighting one lone NPC, ostensibly, in this Quake 3 on steroids game, it's hard to actually find the fucker. Again, don't know what this is. I'm assuming maybe that's bad. Like, don't get caught in it. Or something. It's insane insects. <sighs> so, here we are, on a quest for content. Looking for... Sorry, what? What was that? What What was that? Why? Why the damage there? Was it that thing shooting me from over here? And I've played this game already, and I know these fucking things can barely hit you at point-blank range, let alone from way over there. Terrible. Oh yeah, there are no ammo pickups in the game. When I run out of ammo on this gun, I can't fight. So that's something to be mindful of. Don't mind me, just looking for content. This is published, by the way. This is a published game, uh, published by the fine, fine folks at Strategy First. I'm sure that's a name that's familiar to some of you. This is the end of the map, by the way. Always the sign of a quality gaming experience when the world just ends and there's nothing but oblivion to show for it. Okay, I heard something shoot at me. It looks like the content has found us. Hello? That fucking thing again. There it is. Yep, killed it. Wonderful. And there it is again. Alright. Oh, no, we're dead. One kill remains. How? Oh, not exciting. Not, I can't even say that sarcastically. I swear half the screams we're hearing are just for show. There doesn't seem to be any rhyme or reason for the fucking stuff. Fucking terrible. So terrible. Well, oh. I guess we did something. I guess that's it. We done the kills. We done the kills to win the games. Okay, thanks for that. Now what? Do I get a new level? But yeah, strategy first, they've made... Oh no, that, that was it. Fuck me. That was it, huh? Alright. What's G-Zone? Okay. Alright, there's a bit more to this, presumably. All right, okay. Let's have that. Do we have all the guns? I don't know. Let's just play. It's Angie's Diner again, because why wouldn't it be? But yeah, Strategy First, they've put a lot of shit on Steam. They don't have to go through Greenlight or anything because they're a publisher. Uh, I did a Jimquisition on them once. I might redo that. I may remaster that episode because they really need... They still need a proper slag in. Because they are they are the pits. They've had some decent games now and then, but mostly they're the fucking pits. Anyway, this should be a bit more thrilling, shouldn't it? A bit more exciting. Oh, yep, yeah, just clip through the wall. Don't you worry about it. All right. Look at that. Two kills in a row. This is... This is video games. It's just like Quake. It's just like Quake, everybody. 10 out of 10. Just like Quake. Oh, sorry. I jumped near the poison a bit and took damage, I think. Oh, now we're dead because of something. It's also possible for the game to spawn you over there. Like, off the map. That happened in the last one. I wish I had the footage of it. Because it, it, it's something else. Five kills remaining. Strategy first. Do you know what they should be called? Strategy worst. Thank you. Thank you. 
It took me a lot. It took me a lot to get get where I am today. Uh, you know, coming up with great gags like that. But you know, you put in the effort, you get the rewards. That's what I always say. I believe Matthew McConaughey would agree with me. Uh, Blamo! Come on, come on, come on. All right, that wasn't immediate, but fair enough. Airborne Quake 3 on steroids, that's what this game is. I have seen this game be that thing. Whoa. God, I can't believe I've had to re-record my video of this. This, this is the game I have to put more effort in to get a fucking video of. And I'm busy. I got to get on with that Battleborn that I've been playing. No, nope. well, oh. oh, we won. Extraordinary, extraordinary. Yeah, uh, we'll have a video of Battleborn coming up sometime soon. Maybe tomorrow. Still getting good footage of it. It's one of going to be one of those pre-recorded dealies. Um. I'm liking it. I don't understand any of it because I'm not up on those mobbers like all the cool kids. Um, but the fact that I can't understand it, yet I'm still having fun with it, seems to be testament as to the game's uh, uh, quality. Um, still got to play the Overwatch beta as well. Got to get a review up for um, Severed on the PS Vita. But Okay, so there really is no other map. This tier one warm-up is the best we've got, I guess? I'm not playing it again. Let's just put that out there now. I'm not playing it again. This is this is just the worst. This is dumpster times for bad people. So I'm going. Yeah. I think I'll turn this off and I'll never turn it on again. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. <laughs>